Hello guys, this is Fultan Spy, and in this video I'm gonna show you how I defeated the Cylindropus. I got an easy way to do this. First I call in the air support right away, and while I'm running away from the Cylindropus, I shoot my rockets at him, and I'm running to a vehicle I know the location of, some kind of a anti-air vehicle I think. It has a very high rate of fire, very powerful rounds, so it does a lot of damage in a short amount of time. There is a tank also, a bit further I believe, but you do not want to go for the tank. The tank shoots too slowly and it takes too long to do a lot of damage, basically. Alright, now you can see the attack chopper is already doing damage, which is nice. It's gonna help us a little bit because this uh, motherfucker is a serious pain in the ass. Yeah, at some point he even uh, gets an insta kill attack. And that's very annoying. <laughs> I died like 10 times from that, so. I decided to go with the attack chopper, it makes it a lot more easy. And as you can see, we're doing a good amount of damage here. And my chopper will come in pretty soon here. And then we'll do even, even more damage. As you can see guys, we're almost halfway there. And how long has it been? Two minutes maybe? You're pretty good, why thank you. Thank you sir. And there's my chopper pal. Shooting at Cylindropus. And yes guys, now, pretty soon, some kind of a uh, fog will appear. And that will disable our vehicle. That will make it a little bit more difficult. Yep, there it is, the fog. Anytime now, my vehicle will stop working. But we've done a lot of damage, as you can see. A lot of damage. Now, I suggest you wanna wait until the fog disappears. Just keep firing rockets at him. And apparently my chopper is still up, which is nice. Chopper can fly above the fog, I guess. So it's still doing damage. Keep in mind, guys, the attack chopper might affect the rank at the ending. Like it does in the regular missions. Almost there, almost there guys, just a little bit more. Oh there it is, that's the insta kill attack guys, you gotta watch out for that. Some kind of uh, lightning blast, laser attack combination. <laughs> you don't wanna get hit by that, that's uh, very dangerous. Yep, just make sure you get cover to hide behind. Fire the rockets, get back in the cover, and repeat until he's dead. <laughs> Holy shit. There is my airdrop. It's a little bit too dangerous to get it now, so I'm gonna get another one. Oh, he's coming right for me. <laughs> Yes, airdrops are very important in this case, you're gonna need them, so plan them carefully. Oh motherfucker! But so close, I can smell it. I can smell his death. Oh yeah, this is some kind of um slow motion thing I just shoot him in the face I don't know if there's any specific way to do this I just shoot him in the face and that's it it does damage so I guess it works oh 
Alright guys, at this point we're almost uh, there, he's almost dead. Just keep in mind, you wanna keep behind the cover. Uh, don't shoot in the open, because he's uh, got very powerful attacks now. He's very pissed off, so be careful. Yep, that's what I talked about, very dangerous. You can take a lot of these attacks. Yes, using a dead tank as my cover. That's very smart. Here another quick time event. I'm not sure what you get to do here, but just shoot him in the face. And you should be fine. As you can see the the ginger guy appeared. Uh, and there it is, we killed him. So guys, I hope this helped. I'm not gonna show the cutscene because that's not what this video is about. I hope this helped guys and see you on the next video.